All right, what's up y'all? It's like very and in today's video or you know when you're watching this It's probably months from now uh, for the majority of the people that watch this because I expect this video to get a good amount of views and stuff But anyway, this video is just to show you all of the jerseys um, That come with the relocation team now I could have just put music over this and just played it but uh, I feel like I feel like I'm a YouTuber that just likes to interact with people anyway, rather than just put something out here for you guys. So anyway, I mean, you can still see everything. You can just turn the volume down if you really want to, um, you know, if you don't want to listen to me at all. But uh, this is just me showing you guys everything that you can choose from with all of the all the relocation teams. So as you see, it's Oklahoma City right now. Uh, now, this is interesting because these, these player models look different than uh, most of the other ones. But hey, for all my subscribers who are watching this uh, within the first day of it being out, I would really appreciate if you guys could hit the like button on this to propel, to propel it to get the amount of views where other people that are watching this months from now can see. So if you guys could like the video, even if you're watching this later, if you uh, really just you watching the video and you liking the video it helps me out a ton. So anyway, um, that's just my little my little shout out to myself real quick. This did take me a while, bro. This took me, this took me around like an hour and a half or two hours to, to uh, save. I had, what I had to do is I had to go into the, I had to go into the franchise, save it before I relocated the team and then, um, use that as like the building foundation. And then I went and then I went and relocated and choose my, chose my city and then saved it. I had to, I had to repeat that 17 times and then choose the jerseys, scroll through the jerseys, back out, all that stuff. It it was tough, bro. But anyway, I'm glad I could at least bring you guys this video. So I bet I haven't really been commentating, you know, any of the stuff that's been going on with the with the actual video itself. Right now we got Dublin. Uh, the thing I noticed about them is every one of the jersey schemes is green. <laughs> this looks like the Hurricanes a little bit. Um, but yeah. So there were a couple, there were a couple I really liked. It was a uh, Chicago, the Chicago Blues, um, and then I want to say San Diego had some dope ones too, but I didn't. Uh, San Diego and St. Louis are the only two ones that I didn't show. Uh, I I just didn't really get San Diego's clip in there, but St. Louis, believe it or not, this might save you some trouble if you're planning on doing that. St. Louis, if you choose them, um, you actually can't choose a different like logo or uniforms or anything all you can choose is a different stadium so for instance i did the vikings as you can see in the top right corner oh and the desperados uniforms are sick that these all look nice but anyway um as you can see i'm the vikings in the top right corner um the only thing relocating to st louis allowed me to do was keep my all, all i could change was the stadium that's it <laughs> So yeah, don't relocate to St. Louis if you plan on trying to, you know, get get like some swagged out uniforms. If you want to, uh, you know, have a different logo and stuff like that. Um, Portland, Portland didn't have many good options, but River Hogs is probably the best. Snowhawks, I don't like the color scheme at all. The, this full gray that that's coming up, I think, on Style Two. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, actually, no. Never mind. I, I don't even think I dig the Snowhawks at all. That was that was kind of a whack, a whack color scheme. Uh, now the Aviators kind of resemble the the Panthers uniforms, um, as you can see from this one in the in the style one as well. Um, so now we got Columbus Caps. What would be nice about that uniform right there is if you flip the pants or like any of these uniforms. If you put the white on white and the blue on blue, that would look dope. But yeah, um, that's what I do with most of these things too. Because, or like, for instance, with this, putting full red, like, put the red pants on at home. That would be really cool. Um, now, that that uniform looks stupid. Um, and, and my apologies to anybody who's, oh, yo, condors, condors look sick. I'm going to say that. Condors look amazing for a uniform. Um, I like, I wish every one of these uniforms had the player models like this instead of like this, you know what I mean? Like, it just looks, it looks more lean and like more realistic, you know what I mean? Whereas like, this one looks like, like stubby, basically. Looks like a, like a dude with some, you know what I mean? Like, he looks kind of fat, like a, it doesn't even look like a linebacker because it doesn't look tall, it doesn't look very tall either, but you know what I mean? He looks like a, he looks like a stubby, like, like buff guy, basically. 
Whereas the other one looks like a 6'4 receiver or something like that. You know what I mean? But yeah, these look dope. Um, as I said, I don't know if it's just the player models. I'm not sure. Um, which is something I'd probably be wary of. You know what I mean? You don't want to get misled into like thinking the uniforms are going to look nice just because the player model looks better. But, oh, so I think Chicago Blues were the ones that uh, just came up with the player model looking different. The Chicago Blues look really good. I'm going to say that. Uh, Tigers, not so much. <laughs> uh, these uniforms are probably the best ones if you're going to do that. But yeah, having like blue, blue and orange in the same uniform, nah, that's not... I don't know. So anyway, um, now we got... I did different portions of this video. I was going to split it up into three parts, but I was like, screw it. I don't I don't want to, to have multiple videos based on just this relocation process. So I just brought you guys everything here. So this is literally all, all 16 or 18 teams. I don't remember which. These look weird. These look really weird. <laughs> oh man, Egyptians have a terrible color scheme. This looks like Denver Nuggets throwback. Like, <laughs> oh man, it's ridiculous. Uh, steamers have some dope uniforms. I think, I think maybe style too. I'm not sure. Yeah, it, it depends on the color scheme you like. Cause at the at the same time, having a bright away is kind of whack. Uh, Beats have some nice uniforms too. Like the I like these ones. Um, the all black top and the purple pants. I don't, I think that's too much purple and, and doesn't have a helmet for style too. <laughs> anyway, Brooklyn Bulls. These aren't, these aren't terrible either. As long as you like flip the pants, like I said. Like if you could do all dark blues, that would be dope. Uh, that jersey looks kind of dumb in my opinion too, but. And then you got Brooklyn, Brooklyn, <laughs> Brooklyn Barones, I think, or Barons. I'm not sure. But anyway, hey, like I said. If you guys could like the video though, um, just to propel more people to see this, because that's the way YouTube works, um, I would really appreciate it. Because I, I put some time into this, and I would really appreciate just seeing good feedback and seeing a lot of people watching. These look like the Chargers right here. These look like the Chargers for sure. And then the Flyers aren't a bad uniform, uh, uniform either. I was going to say, I think I like these ones. Uh, the logo looks really dope on it. And then these look okay too, but I'm not, I'm more of a big fan of uh, the other stuff, the other jersey style. Pioneers, I would say this is, a, this is not something I would mess with. I don't like any of the jersey styles or the color scheme at all. <laughs> uh, Orlando Orbits, I, I did this once. I think I did the um, style too, because a lot of these, no, I must have done style one. A lot of these are things that have already been in the game, you know what I mean? So, uh, like I said, a lot of these are things that have already been in the game before. I don't think they even installed any new teams, but I figured I might as well just make the video this year as well, because it's probably what people are going to be searching up. Nobody's going to look up, you know, Madden 17 stuff if we're playing 18. These look like, now, one more from here looks like throwback Vikings uniforms, for sure. Like, that looks like some throwback Vikings uniforms. <laughs> I, I swear. Okay, so now San Antonio Marshalls. That right there. Let me pause it right there. That looks dope. If you put the bottoms as black, or even just even just like that, it looks pretty cool. Um, I wish it had a black helmet. I'm not sure if Style Two had that. Yeah, no. So none of them have black helmet for the style, or for the, you know, for any of the styles. But I like the I like that color scheme though. Black and black and gold looks really good together. So now you got the Dreadnoughts. <laughs> um, I don't really like the color scheme of, of this either. And then you got San Antonio Express. Um, again, I wish the helmet color was different. This this would be all right with the helmet color the way it is. I, I'm a big fan of like the color rush type type uniforms. You know what I mean? Um, okay, so that's the end of that. And then we have one more. Uh, and this is starting with London. So this is the teams that if you go to the right, basically. We got London Monarchs here. Um, I did it a little differently uh, in the first two on accident because this is what I was doing to begin with. So sorry if it's hard to follow right here. Anyway, London Bulldogs. These these could be cool too. Um, I think Style Three. Yeah, Style Three would be really cool. But yeah. Anyway, th this video is coming to a close. Um, I think we got like four more uniforms to show you. Black Knights look really good too. London in general just has some cool relocation teams. 
So, like I said, Black Knights, my bad. I, like I said, I messed up with the, <laughs> with how to show you guys it. So Mexico City, um, I don't know if I'm a big fan of the Golden Eagles. Uh, this looks like the Chiefs a little bit, but, you know, featuring green in the uniform. I don't, I just don't like the whole Christmas colors, like, aspect to it. So Conquistadors, um, again, like, I don't like that jersey style, but I do like that they have black pants. Um, don't really like that jersey style either. It's, and then the socks don't really match anything either. And then we got Diablos. Diablos kind of fit like the Black Knights too. Um, basically same color scheme and stuff. Uh, everything looks pretty straight with this. And then I think only two more. So Toronto has two uh, alternate jerseys, I believe. So the other one had a collar, this one doesn't. And then this one has the stripes on those shoulders. Neither of the other two did. And then you got Toronto Huskies. These would look really cool too. I believe and then I don't know why that just did that that's kind of trippy what the heck <laughs> I don't know man that, that was weird anyway Toronto Mounties um after that now this is like I said man I don't know if it's just the player models I'm not sure but yo if you put blue pants on this it would look really good I know that so anyway that's all for the video hope you guys enjoyed if you did like I said leave a like subscribe if you're new all that good stuff I'm doing Madden videos a little bit, but by the time most people see this, I'm probably just back into the 2K side of things. But even if even if you just sub and never watch any videos, I still appreciate you. Or if you sub um, and, you know, if you, if you watch some of my vids, then I'll appreciate it even more. But anyway, that's all for the video, bro. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Check out my Twitter, Twitch, uh, YouTube, all that stuff. I'm on YouTube, what am I talking about? <laughs> anyway, take it easy, y'all. Peace.